For any business owner, creating a tool to increase your production by nearly 600% in one year would be an amazing feat, and that is just what the assembly line did for American automotive companies in the early 1900s. I'm Brianna with ZF. Take a walk with us as we explore automotive manufacturing history in America. In the early 1900s, prior to the invention of the assembly line, car companies assembled vehicles by hand. A team of workers would build one car at a time, taking approximately 12 hours to complete just one vehicle. The most basic concept of an assembly line is credited to Ransom Olds, who used it to help build the Oldsmobile curved dash. In 1901, Oldsmobile produced 425 cars. Just one year later, the company turned out 2,500 cars, thanks to the assembly line. Old's invention is often overshadowed by Henry Ford, who improved the assembly line with the conveyor belt in 1913. Ford's improvement reduced the time of making a car from 12 man hours to just one hour and 33 minutes, and also reduced the cost to make the vehicle by a third. The growth rate experienced by the automotive industry as a result was unlike anything previously experienced in the U.S. economy and caused a massive shift in the Industrial Revolution. Innovation and industrialization allowed the auto industry to become the backbone of United States manufacturing in the 20th century. While U.S. auto manufacturing looks much different today, the assembly line is still a crucial component. Machinery does the heavy lifting and precise assembly limits the chance of human error. Also, the days of workers using trial and error to make parts fit into the vehicles are long gone. Parts manufacturers, like ZF, create custom parts for specific vehicles that fit precisely. Over the past hundred years, the evolution of U.S. auto manufacturing revolutionized the auto industry and the manufacturing world as we know it today. Imagine what the next hundred years could bring.